10 News reporter Emeril Morrow just confirmed the Hillsborough County tax collector is scanning the office grounds at Hillsborough Ave in 30th Street for possible graves from another African American cemetery that might have been erased. This comes after hearing from the whistleblower who helped rediscover nearly 300 graves from two other lost African American cemeteries. That man first helped uncover Zion Cemetery, which was in the spotlight today at Tampa City Council. Emerald Morrow shares the backstory on how that burial ground was erased. How did Zion disappear and how did buildings end up on top of forgotten graves? In the case of these obliterated African American cemeteries, they're the residues of past violent acts um, that are not gone. When African American businessman Richard Doby established Zion Cemetery in 1901, the odds were stacked against him. Beginning in 1903, J.J. Head, who was a Confederate veteran and was actually the property tax collector for Hillsborough County, tried to place a tax claim on Zion Cemetery to get the property, even though the 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 owners of the property couldn't owe taxes because they're exempt under cemetery status. It was the beginning of a land battle that would eventually erase Zion. That case eventually went before a judge, Judge Robles, ironically, in 1913. Judge Robles ruled uh, in favor of J.J. Head, awarding him, presumably, with the property, even though it was an active African-American cemetery. When the land went up for auction, developer H.P. Kennedy bought it. H.P. Kennedy filed um, tax exemption for cemetery status, unbelievably, um, in 1927, but then in 1928 filed for a building permit so that he could build. Then the cemetery land started being parceled off and sold for development. But he clearly did not move all the bodies because we're finding them all over the footprint of former Zion Cemetery. It's a decades-long process of neglect and collective com complacency and it's ongoing and if cities don't step forward and states don't step forward and governments they're automatically in the process of disappearing the zion cemetery saga actually triggered the search for other erased african-american cemeteries in the tampa bay area you can read all about them on wtsp.com erased